Rufus Sport. This is an incredible team in Milwaukee. You got Harley Davidson, you got Rufus Sport. The two biggest things I can do. Oh, Watch the hand come straight over. Boom! That right hand just starches him. Kashanian tries to come back, but he just is not really there. And then the arm kind of gets trapped behind him. Watch the right hand. Boom! Right on the button. Goes to the guillotine choke. And it is over at that point. You see the leg is trapping the arm, and he goes unconscious right there. All those elbows are good. This is a good elbow attack. Yep, to the ground, not the back of the head, and not that 12 to 6. No. Which... All legal. Under a minute left in the second round, and it's Emmanuel Sanchez controlling Taiwan yeah, Claxton. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's over. It's over. Emmanuel Sanchez. He's going for the takedown. But when he goes for the takedown, look at how he lets go of the leg. And this is where Emmanuel Sanchez hooks up that inverted triangle first. And you see he starts opening up with shots, controls the other arm, but then turns it into a straight triangle. And it's a matter of time. There was things that he was doing that you say, I understand why he's not putting him out. Look at where that right arm is at. That's keeping him in the fight. But it is still taxing on him to breathe. It is creating a problem. And when he changes the angle, like I talked about, that's when the tap comes. He knows that Madrid's biggest strength is his BJJ. He feels his biggest weakness is his power. And takedown defense, oh. and he could not take the power of Evelyn there as Madrid goes down, and Madrid's in trouble. Madrid is finished. Johnny Evelyn improving to 8-0, 4-0 in Bellator. Again, watch the switch step. The right hand comes, it gets blocked, but the left hand comes through and touches that side of the jaw. That's what puts Daniel Madrid in the position where he is trying to defend the hammer fist, seal the deal. It's in the gas tank, makes it to where you just get tired. Beautiful transition right into Mount Mike. You see the full, well-rounded MMA game of Oliver Enkamp on display here in the first four minutes of this fight. Heavy elbows. Big elbows right there, dog getting up. Camp now in a position, looking, he can switch to a Darce, he can go to a Japanese necktie right here. He's got the leg, he's going Japanese necktie. It is all over! Oliver and Camp, another first round finish inside the Bellator cage. Take a look, you see that grip right there, that's telling you, Mike, he has got that neck, and now as he breaks the leg in, look at what happens to the head. The head gets cranked. It's half cranked, half choked, but it hurts. See the tap. Look at where his face is at, Mike. When this thing is on and it's on tight, I want you to look at the position of Emmanuel Dawa's head. Look at how his head is being cranked into his own body. That is a painful submission. That is why you get that tap. Outstanding. Meet the standout wrestler Crutchmer working from top position. And Crutchmer talking about the win in his Bellator debut, showing off his wrestling skill. He says he can use, use it whenever he needs it. And wow, there's a tap! What a submission by Kyle Crutchmer! When Fertrell gets himself to his feet, watch. Crutchmer takes laces from the neck to the arm. It's an anaconda is what he's doing. He never gets the legs, doesn't have to. He's got enough pressure and squeeze. He gets the submission win, even without hooking that leg against Scott Fatrell. Right. Beautiful submission okay. win by Kyle Crutchman. Takes the shot, trying to change levels. Nice kick by Moda. Attacking that lead leg. Back in the inside, you saw it give a little bit of problems with yeah. the control of that foot. But Matt Del Nala, oh, look, look at that, that. Look at that ankle. We're yep. eating. That it's starting to deaden oh, the nerve. He's got a problem. Yep. 
It's over, and it's all over. There's the inside one you saw him again. Twitch, look at the, un, un, the inability to control his ankle, the nerve. You can see right there, he's stiffened his leg. That, that's causing him problems, folds over on that foot. This is what happens from leg kicks when all of a sudden the nerve shuts down and you cannot control.